We're doing it again! We know how much you guys have missed this series. Yeah, I don't look at my comments, but I'm sure if I did, they would say, Wow, Seamus, bring back the, the, the decom reactions. There aren't that many decoms I actually care about to watch anymore. Then I was like, wow, they made a decom with Demi Lovato and Selena Gomez? Well, I gotta watch that, and that's what brings us to today. So, my expectation is this to be like a princess and the pauper type movie, where, like, the princess and this regular person switch lives, and, um, that, yeah, that, that's it. I don't know where the protection program comes in, but, um, I'm sure there's some secret agents in there. I feel like there's a chance I may have seen this movie before, because it came out around the time I would have been watching Disney Channel. There's half of me thinking that halfway through this movie I'm gonna go, I've seen this, I remember this, but who knows, I guess we'll find out. If that happens in the video, uh, Vegard put a text here saying it happened. Royalty and roughing it collide when a princess moves in with a tomboy. Let's get- oh, a decom! Yeah. Oh, tomboy, she's wearing a red hat. Oh, hi, Donnie. Hey, uh... They're not gonna kiss in this one. <laughs> they, they did not waste any time here. Tomboy, red hat- oh, hi, Donnie. <laughs> so, did he ask you to that homecoming dance thing yet? Dad. Dad. Dad, don't embarrass me. Thanks for the bait. See ya. Bye. Imagine just like your friends rejecting you and your dad just standing there and being like <laughs> Although she she was working the counter at her house. I'm confused. Maybe they like own a store and live in it. Yes, sir. Oh, this is the Bluetooth uh, phone, phone era. era. I also remember there was a time, I think they're a bit past it now, where they, it, it had to be blue just to show it was a Bluetooth thing. Like I remember like they'd what? always do a visual cue of it being blue. What are you actually talking about? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Lake Monroe High School. See, it's one of those things where I look at it and I go, that could be important later. I was like, no, it's not it's not gonna be important later. Yeah, I don't, think, I don't yeah. need to be picking up on these these little clues. Rosalinda Marie Montoya Fiore. What? <laughs> go now with Major Mason! Go now! <laughs> The high security they have, and they get caught up in some strawberries and chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> I knew General Kane would try something like this, so I made a plan to protect you. You must trust Major Mason. You must do everything he says. There's like so much depth to like, oh yeah, we're gonna actually overthrow a kingdom, and that usually in a story they'd spend like ages like developing how they've got everyone to take their side and how they've like backstabbed everyone. In this, they're just like, yeah. No, we're just gonna start with this. Start with a simple storyline. You know, they're being different. Yeah, and okay, you know what? Is this some kind of prison? Not prison. Protection. Hello, I am from the Dharma Initiative. <laughs> <laughs> this is the Princess Protection Program! Well, that's it, that's oh the video. God. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to leave go. a like. I'll see you in the next one. <laughs> What about my mother? Who's protecting my mother? She died. She, 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 <laughs> we, he literally just shoved her off <laughs> the castle because that is what would have happened in any other circumstance. Can you tell by the music we're in the middle of nowhere? Who are you? Rosa, uh, Rosie. Are you sure? Because you don't seem sure. Rosie. I'm sure. I love that like she got told this is your new name, stick with it. And the first time she gets asked for a new name, she gets it wrong. <laughs> oh, so wildly different. I think what we're gonna learn is that they're gonna teach each other something useful. Yeah, yeah, that, it's, it, it's not a princess in the pauper story, but it is a princess in the pauper story. Yeah. They're gonna learn the same things they've learned. They're gonna hate each other first, story. and I, then... Yeah. I had to bring her here, the director didn't give me a choice. Does she know what he does? She does. She does. But then why do they run the store? It's a money laundering business. Yeah, I know, but does she know that? <laughs> <laughs> Who do I say she is? Your cousin. <coughs> Carter, thank you. You know what, cousin is the perfect way out, because like, everyone would believe you if you said yes. it's your cousin. You have made other sleeping arrangements? Why is she speaking like that? She's speaking English like she's been speaking another language this entire time. Yeah. <laughs> you will never be the king of Costa Luna, not as long as I'm alive. You are ruining my happy thoughts. <laughs> Why don't they just kill her? <laughs> like, he, she's like, you will never be king as long as I'm alive. 
Yeah. That's the cue to kill her. Look at her. Oh, I know. I totally love the hair. Ow! I don't want to be too critical of this story already, but we're like a third of the way through it. And they're only just introducing what I think are core characters, like at the start of the second act. So structurally, it already kind of feels all over the place. I order you to take a long walk off a short pier. <laughs> Carter, it's gonna work, okay? We just have to give it a little time. How much time? <laughs> How long is she staying with them? Also, they gave her no instructions. Yeah, they they did. didn't teach her anything. Yeah. They said, good luck. Yeah, they, they could have go gone through a crash course of how to be normal. Perhaps I could learn this chores. You could teach me. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> and she's gonna be messy and she's gonna mess something up. In three, two, one. Why did she make that? What's the big deal? Why is she on her bed with shoes on? That, oh, no. Take them off. Yeah. What if their parents meet and fall in love? And then they become sisters for realsies? <laughs> I'm not so sure that's not gonna happen. <laughs> Carter, whatever I did to make you dislike me, I'm truly sorry. I'm just not invested enough in this uh, thing. Like, <laughs> I get this is like the moment. Impossible. Nice shot, Rosie! I think nice we just shot. used the Wii Sports Boys! Impossible. Nice throw! Excuse me, you. you are such a natural! Keep your friends closer and your enemies even closer. No, wait, did I say closer twice? You did, but you, know, you, get it yeah. this, you get it the second. Do it again, you got it. Keep your friends close and your enemies closer. Nice, you got there that. Go. That yeah. was a that really was good take. Yeah, that was the that. first time you said that. I've never worked before, is this normal? Yes, lots of kids have jobs. Then I will help you. You can't. It's less she's a princess so she can't adapt to regular life to more that she's not a human and needs to adapt to human life. Yeah. She might as well be an alien, yeah. as far as I'm aware. I really thought they'd made up and we were just gonna get a nice buddy cop movie from here, but apparently not. You have to wear this. They're gonna do a repeat of the the yogurt storyline from uh, Wizards of Waverly Place, where she messes up the yogurt machine and gets it all, all over herself. <laughs> classic prank. <laughs> Cla the classic prank of get someone a job that get they know they'll mess I, up on. I just got you a job at Frozen Yogurt Store. Take that as a prank! And how do they know that she's gonna mess up? <laughs> They've only met this girl once. <laughs> Wait, she's the one she, person working there? Yes, she actually, they sold her this store and she owns it now. <laughs> Just go, leave. You do not have any requirements to do this job. She didn't even apply. She, you do not need to do this. What are you doing? Are you okay? What are you doing? Why are you here? That, that would be my question. I've just been texted like 10 times. Everybody thinks she's pretty cool. She's indestructible, this girl. She's just like, no matter what she does, it was like, but she did it cool. Yeah. I'd rather eat carbs than see her wearing my crown. <sighs> the popular girls all have eating disorders. Yay. My mother told me that my father never called himself king. To our people, he was father, brother, and friend. Why are they, why are they, uh... <sighs> I don't get why these movies always want us to emphasize with the royals. He may have been the richest person in the country. <laughs> and he may have just completely let people live in poverty, but they loved him. And your princesses are Chelsea Barnes. I didn't know her name was Chelsea, but when they said Chelsea, I was like, that's gonna be the popular girl. Yeah. She's that like, Chelsea's like the Chad of uh, popular girls. <laughs> Do we have to root for the girl that didn't get to be the princess? For the, well, like no, the popular girl that was no. like the rejected There's not popular enough girl time now? In this movie, there yeah. is though. You're my best friend. Oh! How long did that take? How long has it been? Like a week? But she's alone. That, this yeah. is like her first ever friend. So I guess maybe, yeah, it is. But. It's like in Disney movies, they first meet and they go, want to be friends? Best friends. Maybe, maybe the true princess protection program was the friends we made along the way. <laughs> I die. Princess Rosalinda? No way. Also, what is the story going to be? Isn't it embarrassing that you're a real princess? That's actually what it's going to be. What? 
I'm pretty not smart. <sighs> Is Rosie home? Maybe. What's up? Huh? Well, we're planning. A Can you imagine they reveal this to him that they found out he's a pr he's a princess, and then he like locks them up in the bottom of the cabin. <laughs> <laughs> Just shoots them on the spot. I may have to stop calling you pal. What? 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 Uh, what did that mean? You're what? no longer a tomboy, like. Or Is that if that's the line? I guess. But what? also, let's be clear here. She wasn't actually much of a tomboy throughout the movie, no. other than the fact she was wearing a hat in the opening <laughs> scene. That was all there was to that. I, until you brought that up, I forgot she was a tomboy. Masks? I'm from a mask. Oh, I get it. I get it. Because um, Selena Carter is wearing the dress that the other girls should have been wearing so that when they come to get her and they've dressed their hair the same, they're gonna take Selena instead of Demi. This is actually the princess and the pauper. They've actually just swapped lives. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and the winner is... Princess Rosie Gonzalez. Can you actually imagine showing up at a school for a week and then winning homecoming? While you're friend gets kidnapped by a bunch of royal <laughs> <laughs> Since I've been here, I've learned many wonderful things. Most importantly, friendship. learned about friendship. <laughs> <laughs> no! She flew into that water. Stop bringing you back for this! You are never gonna see her again, unfortunately, yeah. Chelsea. General K. Why haven't they taken the, oh, how? They've been walking for like a while. How did she catch up with them? We're turning you over to the international authorities. But Thank actually, you. on whose ground does arrest him here? <laughs> like, are we talking like the UN or NATO here? Like, who, who's intervening in this? <laughs> She's like, we're turning you over to the international authorities. Nobody moves. Oh God, why is she trying to make this movie about herself, man? This isn't about you, Chelsea. You're literally a side character in this movie. You know what I actually like? There was no you need a boy thing in this. No, there wasn't actually. They both rejected their, yeah. their man. I think that's actually the best thing. Frozen done. was inspired. <laughs> okay. okay, what did we think of the movie, Vegard? Um, one positive. I didn't ask for your opinion. <laughs> <laughs> you know what, I actually, there was one thing I do appreciate about it, there was no real love interest. I actually think like compared to a lot of Disney Channel original movies, this one isn't as much sticking to the formula. As you pointed out when we were watching it and just now, um, they don't have the two main girls get boyfriends in the movie, which is not something, they, there isn't really a love interest in the movie at all. She becomes the queen at the end of the movie, but there's not like a king. There were a lot of cliches, but there weren't as many cliches as you would come to expect. There were a lot of things that were stupid about it, and but it was also a lot. I, and it was a good length, it didn't go on too long. I, I actually felt like that went by fast, the fastest of all of the ones yeah. we've watched. I have no recollection of how long the other ones took because they were so long ago now, but um, Still, they yeah. felt like... Your arms hour. didn't get tired during it. I kind of, I'm kind of sad this movie doesn't have a sequel, to be honest with you. Anyway, I don't really care enough to ramble on about that. Hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you like the Princess Protection Program and you want to bring the DCOM reaction series back or just reactions to other things like this, leave a like and let me know what you would like to see us react to next. Subscribe, check out my Patreon, watch my, uh, just subscribe, check out another video, check out my Twitch down in the description down below and also my Patreon, you can ch uh, <sighs> You can subscribe, check out my Twitch in the description down below, you can also watch, ah, uh, why can't I do this? Okay, um, we got it. Are you sure? No, I wanna get this right. <laughs> You can subscribe, check out another video, check out my Twitch and Patreon in the description down below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one if you choose to watch it.